Hello and welcome. This video will take you through the basics of getting started with UDStream. For more advanced articles and resources, visit our website. Step one is creating your UDStream account. In any web browser, navigate to udstream.euclidean.com to load the portal. If you're a new user registering for the first time, select register. Enter your name and email address that you would like to use for your account. Next, check your email client for your validation link. Click the link to open the portal, then enter your password twice to create your account. Log into the portal and you will see a range of options for downloading and accessing UDStream. Today we'll be using the Windows version. Click the download button, then run through the installer. Step 2. Launching UDStream The UDStream app can be found in the Start menu. Search UDStream, then click on its name to launch the app. Log in with the username and password that you just created. Upon login, you will find the welcome screen. Any data sets viewed in UDStream can be organised, stored and shared inside a project. On the left, you'll see a list of projects that have been recently opened. On the right, there's options for starting a new project. At the top is a link to our Help Centre for support resources. This screen also contains some featured projects, which I'll tell you more about in a moment. For now, press Dismiss while I take you through the interface. The interface, menus and buttons of UDStream are quite minimalist, so you can make the most of visualising your data. The vertical panel from the top left contains scene tools, annotations and measurements. The horizontal panel contains projects, convert and settings. In the bottom right corner, there's even more quick access buttons for maps, visualization and full screen. Step three, loading a project. Now let's load a sample project that's been stored on Euclidean's server. To open, I'll select the scene profile menu, Euclidean samples, then the top sample project. All data associated with this project loads instantly. To control the camera, hold the left mouse button while moving up, down, left or right. This tumbles the camera and rotates the angle of your view, but won't move you anywhere. Hold the right mouse button and move your mouse to begin panning the camera. Use the scroll wheel to zoom in or out, or click the scroll wheel to pivot around that point. On the keyboard, use the W and S keys to move forward or back, the A or D to move left or right, while the R and F move the camera vertically, up or down. To change the speed of the camera from the top panel, select Settings. Click Appearance, then tick Show Camera Information. Drag the Move Speed slider left or right to make the camera faster or slower. To open the Scene Explorer, Click Show Hide Scene Explorer on the left. Here you will see all the data sets and associated elements that are part of this project. You can click on the white arrows next to different folders to open the elements. And double click on items to fly the camera to them. Take a moment to click through some and explore the project yourself. This video has shown you the basics of navigating UDStream. There is much more to learn. For more resources, visit our website at www.euclidean.com. Thank you for watching.